the skyrocketing cost of mortgage insurance could make FHA loans a bad deal. I'm Elise Glink with today's Real Estate Minute. Many potential homebuyers who need a mortgage but lack a 20% down payment will look to the FHA for a loan. It allows you to put down as little as 3.5%, but that savings up front could cost you in the long run because of mortgage insurance premiums now required by the FHA. Premiums have doubled over the last five years. Insurance on a median-priced home, say $212,000, used to be just over $9,000 for the first five years. Now, buying that same home will cost more than $17,000. What's even more disturbing is that in most cases, even after you have 20% equity in your home, the FHA won't cancel your premiums, unlike conventional lenders. You'll have to continue paying the premiums for the entire life of your FHA loan. The only way an FHA loan could be beneficial is if your credit score is below 660 or if you have a very, very small down payment and can't get decent financing through a conventional lender. Then, whatever you pay for PMI is worthwhile. I'm Elise Glink. For more details and links, visit my website, thinklink.com, where we're rebuilding America one house at a time.